Hello there, my YouTube channel. <laughs> Does this thing work? Ooh, baby, this does work. Okay, um, <laughs> I'm a big fan of that girl, Joanne Sedea, Sedea, John Cena, whatever her name is. And she uses this all the time, so I thought, why not go purchase? <laughs> <laughs> While me showing my unmade bed, that is so, so humbling. No stars, they're just like us. <laughs> anyway, I recently asked everyone to send me in, what are your favorite Disney walls and everything? Because I was going to like mm, take photos next to them or something. No, I did something even better. I decided to review, review all of them after visiting them. And um, my only mistake with this is that I forgot to actually take photos at them. But I'm reviewing all your walls. Um, and I'm going to rank which one is superior. Well, I'm going to say which one's superior. So first we have the wall located at the most beautiful girl in school, also known as the Epcot Ball, aka Spaceship Earth. It's at the exit of the ride. And, you know, Disney has ears themed after it, so I guess she kind of goes hard. But, you know, it's pink, shades, and purple, or blue, I don't know, shades. So yeah, it's cool. Hey. Hey, On to our second wall here again where Heidi's showcasing her beautiful camera work. <laughs> so the purple wall located in Tomorrowland. It is purple, it is a wall, and it has some geographic patterns on it. And uh, you just gotta show her off. She's looking real spicy while I'm wearing this yellow. Hey. Bro, I don't even know if this is considered a wall. I just know that this is where Peter Pan meets, so yeah. Hey. Next, we are at my girl Dak. I love her. And we are at the You Are Most Beautiful wall. It's I actually really do enjoy this one. Um, minus the fact that last time I stood in front of it, there was just like a really weird typo. So, um, yeah, boogie on, oogie down to Dak so you can stand next to this beaut. I love her. She's so beautiful. Hey. Hey. Next, we have the Fichua Wall in Dak, which is located in Africa, slash bike thingy. I don't know why I tried getting on it. I had on a skirt. But anyway, it's really cute, and you know, follow along. Uh, come on, Heidi. And here we have the actual Mickey Wall, they call it. Fellow. And you know, it's really cute. Like, you know, just mimic Mickey's pose, and you can get it on and pop in. I definitely, you know, Dak's just great. Hey. <sighs> Sorry, I had a yawn. The next is the tandem bike wall in Jack, and you know it's a tandem bike next to a wall. And once again, here I am. I just decided to grab a partner because why not showcase a tandem? Why showcase a tandem bike by yourself? You're just gonna look silly. So me and Brittany, you know, we're getting on this thing. Ooh, she Loki just fell. <laughs> but yeah, you know, grab a butt. Oh God, that was so awkward. It's cute. Hey. Okay, this one's low key an accidental fine, and it's in the queue line at Slinky Dog, um, so it kind of slaps. Honestly, Toy Story Land has some of the best walls and studios, and that's the truth. Anyway, next is this popsicle wall, and it's really cute if you're wearing like pink stuff, but there was like people walking by, so I just had to. Whoa, okay. <laughs> oh, Yes, you read that correctly. The best Disney wall is not even located on Disney property. It's located at Disney Gift Outlet. Come on, Heidi. Show them what you're working with. Let's show them that how this is the best wall, baby. The best. She's beauty, she's grace, and she's going to fall in the next frame. <laughs> 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 okay. <laughs> 
my beautiful wall is a space themed wall that has you know a patriotic yet space adventure thing going on and you know it's very me there's just so much going on in this to the point where you're confused and that sums up my brand in just a singular wall it's beautiful you can bring the friends with you you can bring the family you know you can even get a good deal on some shirts i got this really cute florida shirt from there and i cropped it and you know it was definitely worth it but you know 10 out of 10 this wall is the winner and i'm not being biased at all I just also want to say thank you to all these lovely people who sent in walls um, I should probably mention the fact that there are two walls I would I wanted to visit but just never got the chance to because I'm I'm a fake busy person. Uh, the first being the Emily Enchanted Wall, which is in Storybook Circus. I'm still confused where that is located. I have no clue. I've tried. I've seen. I think I've seen it, but I just don't understand how people are able to get to it. I just, so I just gave up. I apologize. Maybe I'll Photoshop, Photoshop myself next to it and insert a photo if I actually do it. Let's hope I did. And the second one being the Kyle Palo one, uh, which is like that Ebscot galaxy wall thingy. I'm never in Ebcot, literally never in Ebcot. Every time I try entering Ebcot, it, I just I just really don't go to Epcot and I have no beef with Epcot. I'm just never in Epcot. So <laughs> Sorry <laughs> That was so ugly